Ministry's Defence and Space has moved a step closer to securing an Indian contract for 56 E295W medium transports within country flight trials of the type having been completed. The C295W program is progressing smoothly and we have successfully completed the field evaluation. Trial of the aircraft in India, as well as the maintenance evaluation, the company confirms. While declining to provide specifics of the program's current status, it adds. The acquisition is progressing well, as per the DPP Defence Procurement Procedure. Several further steps need to be taken as part of India's labyrinth and notoriously time-consuming defence procurement system before a formal contract can be signed. The Defence Acquisition Council, which is led by Defence Minister Mano Parika, gave its go-ahead for the programme in May 2015, having deferred a decision six months earlier. And the effort to acquire the type has been underway since 2012 to replace the Indian Air Force's aged fleet of HS 748s. The C295W acquisition will procure 16 aircraft to be supplied directly in flyaway condition by Airbus Defence and Space, plus 40 to be assembled in India. In partnership with Tata Advanced Systems TASL, the designated Indian production agency, India's Coast Guard has also expressed interest in acquiring the C295W and received separate briefings about the aircraft. However, the Coast Guard requirement, if it materializes, does not currently form part of the aircraft that we propose together with Tata in the context of the Avro replacement. Airbus Defence and Space has previously confirmed. The C295W program is a cornerstone of TASL's defense manufacturing plants in India. We hope this will act as an anchor for us to get the type of capability and skill set that can then attract many other programs, Chief Executive Sukar and Singh told Flight Global earlier this year. This will really differentiate us from anyone else in India, he added. The baseline aircraft for India will be the new C295W for which the Mexican Navy was the launch customer.